everyone, my name is Lauren and welcome to a brand new episode of Hogwarts Legacy. When I tell you I could not stop thinking about this game all day, I'm not even exaggerating. I just wanted to run home and just play this game for five hours straight. <sighs> As you can probably tell, I kind of played around with my recording settings. I am now recording in OBS rather than in Streamlabs, so this is a little bit of a test as well. So I really hope it goes well. Fingers crossed. <laughs> also, make sure that if you liked the video, give me a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel if you want to see more episodes. And uh, I can't wait to see your feedback. Anyway, without further ado, let's dive right in. We were about to start this quest with Professor Weasley in a Transfiguration classroom, which I think we should do right now. How's what about the room, Professor? I was Love his thinking hair. the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Oh, uh, excuse, Deke. Hi, Deke. Ah, there you are. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit before you arrived. I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me, isn't there? She keeps prying. Hasn't Professor Fig said anything? I think that's more of a vague answer and it's not of a, like much of a lie, so I'm gonna go with this one. Have you and Professor Fig not discussed my training? He continues to be reticent about the details, mentioning only a few spells. Revelio, was it? And Lumos? Yes. That's correct, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streeler. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> what more work? <laughs> something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, cool, thank regarding you. the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned <gasps> earlier, we're going we've shopping. arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. I cannot You've managed wait. your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. Cool. Um, what can you tell me about the potion shop? What spellcraft? So there really isn't Ollivander's there. I feel like I kind of know these things already. So I'm just gonna say I'm ready to go. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Oh, who Perhaps should we take? Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. Oh. I've noticed you spending time with them. Oh, see, we really get along with Natty, but I kind of want to see what's going to happen with Sebastian. Because there is a vibe there, right? Just me? I'm going to go with Sebastian. I'd like to go with Sebastian. Glad to hear it. Mr. Sallow is a capable young wizard, and he knows the area. They're going to be quite fun. well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to Ooh. avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. Okay, no get to know. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the three <gasps> broomsticks. I'm allowed to drink? I always saw butterbeers were um, alcoholic, so maybe they're not. Revelio. Also, let's just use Revelio just to check there's... Um, there's any chests around here? Oh, there's a lock on this door. Speak to Professor Ronan to receive your first assignment. Assignments are types of quests given to you by Hogwarts professors that when completed reward you with new spells. The reward for completing your first assignment will be the Mending Charm Reparo. Very useful, which is required to complete the other quest. You can track assignments and their progress in the quest menu of your field guide. I'm just gonna check this out. Okay, so we're gonna need Alohomora. At some point. Yeah, see there's chests in there. I want these chests, ma'am. I don't think there's anything else we can get, so let's just go outside for now. Okay. Let's go report to the professor. <gasps> let's pet the cat. Starting the day off well. And then meet the professor Ronan to complete our quest, because I would love to learn some more spells. I think that's going to be very useful to do as soon as possible. 
um, to learn as many spells as possible. Ah, there you are. Hi, Professor. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that, the mending charm Repero. Fixes things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm, it seems as if that might come in handy. More mm -hmm. frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. <laughs> we will have you casting Ropero in no time. Thank you very much, sir. I really like him. I'll complete a task. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. Thank you. All right, you guys. Um, I don't know what these dots mean. Oh, that's just where I have to go. This is the right area. I wonder where the flying page is. Flying page. Accio, I had to do. Got it. There you go. Watch me do an accidental avada kedavra at some point. <laughs> oh God. Oops, um, okay, so I burned the floor of Hogwarts, that's fine. Like I said, accidental of Ada Kedavra, I could totally see it happening. Around here somewhere. Brilliant. There we go. Got a few more. I really hope you guys will enjoy this series as much as I do, you guys. I trust the preliminary tasks weren't too much trouble. No, that was fine. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. What can I Let say so talented? Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Yes. Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Okay. Yes. Remember, your wand is a conduit of your magic. Oh, God. Okay, there we go. Nice. We did it. Okay, so we now know the mending spell. The mending char repair can be used to mend broken objects and pieces of the environment. That's it. Very good. If you would like to practice mending something, have a go yes. with that broken statue. I'm wanting to in try this for ages. It allegedly symbolizes. Oh, so satisfying. Hunting. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. Oh, that's really sad. Okay, cool. We completed our quest. Um, okay, so we need to visit Hogsmeade and gather our supplies, which is the next thing we need to do. I'm also gonna join the dueling club at some point, because I feel like we might as well get as much out of Hogwarts as possible. Wow. <gasps> Can you imagine taking a class in this room? Holy crap, it's beautiful. Um, oh, hello. Uh, field guide page. Urn of Ashes. This particular urn is rumored to have once born the inscription pioneer in dragon taming. Should not have started with the Hungarian horn tail. Oh gosh, that's the worst one. Let's get this page. Sleeping dragon statue. The Hogwarts motto Draco Dormiens Nunquam Titilandus means never tickle sleeping dragon. Fortunately, this particular sleeping dragon is made of stone and will never awaken. It may be tickled to absolutely no effect. What I quite like about this game is that I'm 100% sure no one's done the same playthrough so far. Like, no one's done the exact same route as... Rebellion. Me, which is very, very cool. Okay, I'm in a creepy, creepy stairwell, but that's fine. Where am I? What the hell is this place? Rebellion. Why am I nervous? No, don't close. Nice, got another um, field page <gasps> and a chest. Hello, an autumn scarf. Um, excuse me, I'm gonna wear that right now. Yeah, cute. That's a cute outfit. Dude, we are cute as heck. Anyway, um, let's go back. Nice. One more. Oh, we just leveled up. Amazing. 
Wait, we can use this? <gasps> Whoa! That's so cool. I saw this tweet from someone saying, the only thing you're missing in this game so far is photo mode. And I think that's a very good point. Revelio. Okay, that's nothing. All right, let's check in with this girl because this is a side quest. Is everything all right? Oh, hello. Hi, Thank Cressida. Thank you for asking. I'm Cressida, by the way. Cressida, sorry. And I'm afraid everything's not all right. I may be in a spot of trouble with the librarian. You see, I'm fond of creating my own charms. Thought I'd perfected my light as a feather charm to use on my library books. My arms get so tired carrying them around all day. But I must have confused the Latin word for feather with bird in my oh, incantation. No. Because when I opened my bag just now in the library, they literally took flight. We can help you. <laughs> that sounds brilliant, actually. Yeah. Thank you. Somehow I don't think the librarian will see it that way. I collect I can try the books and, and remove the charm myself. Except this isn't the first time one of my charms has threatened the peace of the library. Our meat Might lose told some Madam there. Scribner they were my books flying around. So she said that if I caused her any more trouble, she'd write to my parents. Perhaps you could get them for me. There are only five. She won't be suspicious of a new student. Don't you worry, around. I've got you. I'll help you out. I'll help you. Yeah, why did Amit tell on you? Why That's did really Amit sneaky. Tell Madam Scribner that they were your books. Oh, to be perfectly honest, I don't think he meant any harm. I think he was impressed. Bragging on my behalf. Still, I feel like that's a bit a of a sneaky thing to do, stars, not gonna lie. Like, he must have known what he did. Charm when he sees one. Right, okay, I um, I will I do it. Help if I have the time. Oh, I'd very much appreciate it. One of the books is my diary. I'd rather it not fall into the wrong hands. Okay, girl, we got you, don't worry. If you can collect them and bring them to me, I can remove the charm. I wonder what's in a diary. I hope we can read it. <laughs> I totally would, not gonna lie. Actually, I don't know if I would. Would I? Um, there's something in here. Oh, where am I? Oh, oh, this is the I'm library. Going to have to <gasps> use Pacquio to get to those books. Oh my god! I don't think we've seen it like this before. Oh my god! Do you guys remember when I watched the trailer that I said all I wanted to do was sit in the library and read the books and study? I totally would. I would 100% study for my exams right now. My owls. Accio. No one Got will it. know. I need four more to go. No one will know. Where was the other one? There were two here. Nice. Nice! Okay, we just finished this quest. I'm pretty sure we should be able to collect an item now. Um, I love twisting all these. I wonder if there's going to be a little um, reward when you finish doing that with all of them. Oh, quickly. Gotta act fast. This must be Cressida's diary. I'd want this back too if I were... We're reading it. I mean, if you insist, I love a bit of drama. Today was a good day. That is until Gareth splashed whatever ridiculous concoction he was creating all over my perfectly stewed lacewing flies. I had to empty my entire cauldron and start all over again. To be fair, that's really annoying. He's such a menace. Oh gosh. <laughs> Thinks he knows everything there is to know about potions. Always disrupting Professor Sharp's class with his experiments. I'm utterly convinced that if he wasn't Professor Weasley's nephew, he would have been expelled by now. Arbor of Smokies again tonight for dinner. I'm becoming more partial to them now, although I still prefer meat pie. That is awkward. Oh, page. Nice. The old librarian. One of the first librarians of Hogwarts is depicted here. Rumor is that he had no tolerance whatever for noisy students and was known for his liberal use of the silencing charm at a slightest sneeze. Nice. Is that all of them? No, one more. Or it's one over there. There's a chest here. Oh, some dueling gloves. Hello. That's the last book. Nice, that's the last now, one. Take them back to Cressida. Oh, is that the librarian? Don't mind me. Oh, just everything about this game. I am completely and utterly in love with this game. 
Oh, a forest scarf. Oh, that one's really nice. It looks homemade. Oh, nice. We can collect these gloves. And then we can almost collect this hat. Well, we can't almost collect it. But we, you know, we're getting there. All right, Cressida. I got you. Hello, Cressida. I collected your books, including your diary. Oh, what a relief. And I read Thank it. Thank you. I'll happily take the heavy lot off your hands now. That is so mean. Perhaps a reward to keep the diary a secret? No. Yeah. Well, lesson learned. I certainly won't be practicing any charms in the library again anytime soon. Now, to work out where I went wrong. Perhaps I should start brushing up on my Latin. Yeah, probably. Thank Guys, goodness, some so... people are trustworthy. Certainly wouldn't want anyone but me reading my diary. Well, I kind of read it. Um, so I am planning on doing an evil run of this game as well. I'm going to play the first run. It's going to be the way I would actually do it in real life. Um, see what feels right in the moment. However, who knows what might happen after. Oh wait, was Sebastian in the library? Did I just completely miss him? We can interact with this. Oh. I'll take this chest. Oh my god, that's kind of claustrophobic. Jesus. It's just really funny, like, hearing all their conversations. Oh, look at this. It's so beautiful. The architecture, dude. Oh, Paige. Sorry, Sebastian. I'm coming. Still Paige. This broken broom belonged to Celine Wardnaby and is rumored to be all that remains after she insisted on demonstrating her experimental lunar apparitions charm to fellow third years. No one knows if she succeeded. That's, um, kind of scary. Not gonna lie. <laughs> what do we get? money okay hi sebastian <laughs> hello sebastian just got ah, a bit distracted again my new charge i'm told you're in dire need of supplies and i'm to accompany you into hogsmeade for them is this your first foray into the village it is i haven't left the castle since i arrived well i shall endeavor to be the very best of guides then hogsmeade's a charming little place self-contained too we should be able to find you everything that you need shall we yeah, that sounds good. He's actually so kind. I'm pretty sure my second house would have been Slytherin, you know. I'm really ambitious. Oh my god. <sighs> I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to join you today. As am I. Thank you, by the way. Of course. You're the only one who's ever bested me in a duel. The way I see it. I'd be wise to keep an eye on you. <laughs> Is that some flirting, I suspect? <gasps> I thought I was the Weasley, fifth film. She seems to have taken quite a shine to you. Oh, Has she? Nice. That's nice to hear. I'm still surprised that a professor oh would entrust God. me with anything. Given so, my detention record. I'm sorry, Sebastian. I know I'm interrupting Spend you. Spend a lot of time in detention, do you? just enough to keep me well but rounded. one of my art directors i work in the film industry one of my art directors has um did this the quidditch pitch and i think that's so cool oh my gosh this is the first time we're actually venturing outside of hogwarts how fun Speaking oh my god it's beautiful this trip to hogsmeade might have saved me from one glad i could be of service madam scribner the librarian was on the hunt for me as is often the case. Professor Weasley came to retrieve me, and I was able to convince old Scribner that I had somewhere to be. Dude, what the? I'm on the verge of tears again. I'm gonna cry my way through this Let's Play. You can clearly tell how much this means to me, like... Holy fuck. This is insane. So how did you manage to get on the librarian's bad side? Well, I suspect it's a matter of differing opinions. What happened? She thinks I shouldn't be allowed in the restricted section. And I, on the other hand, am inclined to disagree. Oh, oh what's this? Just one moment. 
This is an excellent spot to gather lacewing flies. Oh, They're yeah. They're to look at. If you stew them long enough, they make a powerful potion ingredient. Okay, good to know. Thanks, dude. Yeah, we got some. <laughs> Sounds like they're talking. Thanks, Sebastian, for the tip. Let's keep going. What's that ruin over there? That bridge also looks like it's about to collapse. Merlin's beard from the Forbidden Forest. Look. What's going on? See for yourself. Hippogriffs! Quite a sight, isn't it? You certainly don't see that every day. Hippogriffs! Fuck me! <laughs> you think Poppy's already seen the hippogriffs? Absolutely. Why oh my anything? god. To the left is the Forbidden Forest. <sighs> Out of bounds to all students. Hence the name. Precisely. They think it's too dangerous. I think they need to have more confidence in our defensive abilities. Ah, you can see Hogsmeade just past those ruins up ahead. I just, I can't even describe how much this means to me. Have you Look had much this. of a chance to explore the castle? Uh, a little. Oh, oops. it's positively enormous. Oh god, we can climb it over things. That. I've been there five years and barely scratched the surface. Dude, Loads yeah, it's insane. See. Places to discover. Oh, any you'd like to share with the class? Perhaps one day. I can't go around telling you all my secrets now, can I? You still yeah. haven't told me how you became so good at dueling. Hey, dude, I'm just gonna explore some of this. There's little houses everywhere. Dude, I just... I don't know how I'm ever gonna finish this game or explore everything. I've always thought Thestral's pulling a carriage a bit grim. Though I suppose most people don't actually see them at all. But you can see them. Unfortunately. But you've seen quite a bit yourself firsthand too. Most notably that dragon attack. Hopefully the rest of your year isn't in the Thank you, Sebastian. He's genuinely such a nice dude. I do want to hang out with Natty next as well. I think it's important to have our friendships. <gasps> Cat! Sorry, pit stop. I'm getting so distracted, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm trying. It's just I want to do everything. I feel like I've already missed so much. Mr. Moon. He's the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Huh? Hi. Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Dude, Pleasure. you look so uh, cool. You might want to turn back, Mr. Sallow. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Have you been drinking, oh, sir? Right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What did, Mr. Huh? Moon? Demi guys. Ugly and airy and terrifying. I show me the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. A Demi guys. I don't know what he's putting in his pumpkin juice, but he's obviously yeah, that's had too weird. much of it. I've never seen Mr. Moon in such a state. Nice. Moonstone. Mr. Moon is quite the character. My sister Anne thinks he's lovely, but I'd say he could improve a bit as a caretaker. Oh, is your sister in Slytherin too? She is, or rather, oh she was. Oh my god. She's not well at the moment, but she'll be better soon and back at Hogwarts. <gasps> I just... I just, I don't know if my heart can take this, you know? <sighs> the music as well? Dude. Revelio. I want to go into every single place. Honestly, if one could bottle Wait, the magic there's a chest. This place, I don't know if it's the shops or the people, but there's just something about Hogsmeade. We all flock to it like moths to a flame. Spectacles. Oh, Half Moon ones like um, Dumbledore. I just could only think of the Dutch name for a second. I should imagine you always have room for an extra cauldron. Oh my god. So how would you like to do this? Weasley told me you had a list of things to get, a wand and some other bits. Yes, Dittany seeds, some spellcrafts, and some potion recipes. Perfect. 
Can't wait to see what you do with the new wand. Thank you. And a short list gives you plenty of time to poke around the village. I just have to pop into a shop to find something for my sister. Let's meet up in the town circle when you're finished. Okay, that sounds good. See you soon. Remember, have fun. It's Hogsmeade. Hogsmeade Village is brimming with different sites, shops and other points of interest that you can navigate using your field guide's map. Let's check. Oh my god, there's a hairdresser. There is the wizardware shop. Oh my god. Brood and Peck. Chippin's Potions. Ollivander's. Sporting Needs. Tomes and Scrolls. That sounds epic. Hogshead. Oh my god. <gasps> the Joke Shop. Broomsticks. Three Broomsticks, sorry. Hogsmeade Square. Steeply and Sons. And Honey Dukes. I want to check everything out. And what is this? <gasps> the Abandoned Old Building. Where do we start? We should go to Ollivander's first. I reckon, yeah, let's get our one first. Actually, I didn't think about that. Why is there one in Hogsmeade? Maybe I should have asked that. I didn't clock it. Rebellion. That looks like Dumbledore. Wow. I always wanted to have a moment like this. I'll I have right Harry's with... wand at home. Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. Hi. You must be a different Ollivander. Uh, mm. Hello, sir. I'm looking for... For a new wand, yes. It's Maybe about he started time. out yes, in... I... About Hugs time. Me. Well, you're our new 50th Sorry. student, are you not? <laughs> it's oh, late. What am I saying? Of course Again. you are. Gerbold <laughs> Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest wand makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you. Truly. I like the wand behind your ear. me. Let's find you the perfect one, shall we? Yes, please. Mm, uh, no, 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 not you. Um, ah, yes, yes. Mm, powerful core, ten and a half inches. Mm, you might do. Here, that's give big. Want to try? Oh, it's beautiful. Well, go ahead, swish. Hmm. No. How odd. Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. I don't think that was a good idea. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> I wonder how many times his shop has well, been set on fire. This is all, is it? <laughs> uh, um, we'll find you something, not to worry. Mm. No, not you. Uh, uh, mm. Perhaps. Yes. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. Mm-hmm. Let's give this one a try. It looks like it's got barbed wire around it. Oh, oh okay. Uh, Sorry about that. Looks like mm. it's back to the <laughs> shelf for you. Uh, this is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um... Where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. Ooh, I like yes. the box. Very pretty color. I think you might be the one. Here, take it. Oh, here we go. This will be the one. This is my one. This is the one. This is the one I have. Oh, Pottermore. Wood type hazel, core type unicorn hair, flexibility rigid, and wand length is 13 and a half inches. Oh, I can choose the... I can choose the design. How intriguing. <gasps> I love... I love the... No, I want... I want this. That's beautiful. I'm gonna stick with unicorn hmm. hair because I know my one. unicorn wand. hair wand is most reliable and faithful to its owner. I want to keep ash brown though. I think that's beautiful. All right. I'm about to purchase my wand. What do you think? Extraordinary. 
<laughs> That's the one. Another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. Thank you so much, Ollivander. <sighs> now, how did that feel? Good. Different. Amazing. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. Indeed. I can't wait. Treat it well, and you shall find no more dependable a wand than one with a unicorn hair core. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of oh, further assistance. Oh, I'm just assistance. gonna sob my way through this. I just, I don't know how I'm emotionally gonna handle all this. Oh, I have my wand now. Thank you so much. Bye, Ollivander. I have a wand, people. I also really want to check out Honeydukes, not gonna lie. Let's search this bag. Okay, we found 13 gold. I'm sorry that, if that was your gold bag. Welcome to J. Pippin's Potions. Hi. Just gonna have a quick look around. A fedora? Hell yeah. Sweet. Um, hey, sir. Oh my gosh. Why is everything so amazing in this game? Look at the set design. Perry Pippin. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. Pardon me, sir. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. It's Leviosa, not, not Leviosa. Not that she here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time no, in Hogsmeade, sir. actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Love potions his accent. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. <laughs> How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. Yes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent and the some ingredients, I guess? I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potions. Exactly. Supplies. I want to get started the on these classes. Art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. Are potions really that versatile? They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses. And I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Okay, thank you so much. But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? Let's do that. What can I do for you today? Um, I want to get some recipes. So I think this one we definitely need Wigan Well recipe because obviously that's a healing potion. Um, feel free cool. to take a look at the rest of my inventory, or come back another time. I if you're do in not a rush have the today. money for this Maxima potion. Okay, and then we've got all these ingredients. Thing is, I don't know what we need. Okay, so the Edoras potion is a potion that enhances drinkers' defense by covering them with durable rocky skin. We need mongrel fur and ashwinder eggs. Revelia. I'm just gonna check out if there's anything nearby. Oh wait, there was um a page. Right, magic neep card. This card belongs to Timothy Teasdale, who runs the magic neep. He enjoys being in the thick of things and engaging with customers outside the shop. Cool. All right, let's speak to him. Pardon Hello, me, Timothy. Sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you then. Yes, please. Merlin's beard. Want to craft some potions, you know? Fifth year. You must them. be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way. And this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm in the way inside now, can I? I suppose not. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a packet of Dittany seeds? 
Yes, that sounds perfect. Let me guess. You're after something fresh. All right, let's check. Well, we need some Dittany seeds. Do have a look around. Plenty of ingredients Lexi, to not pique grass. your interest, I'd wager. Okay, well, I can't afford any of these, and I kind of want to spend my money at um, fertilizer. Listen, I'm going to do all this at some point when I have more money, but I kind of want to go to Honeydukes. Wait, I can... I can combat roll? I didn't even know I could do that. Gotta pet them all. Alright, let's see if we can go inside and have a look. In Zongos. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, hello. <laughs> Is he wrapping stuff? Oh my gosh, that's so cool. What's this? Ooh, oh my gosh. <laughs> Ooh, some extra coins to spend in here. I hope we can buy some candy or something. That'd be fun. Oh my god, look at all this stuff. I wonder if there's really crazy flavors. The graphics are also very cool. Oh, I'm floating. Oh my gosh. Oh. Revelio. Nice. Fizzing whiz whizbees. <laughs> These delicious sweets, rumored to contain billywig stings, are small sherbet balls that, when consumed, will levitate one in one a few inches off the ground. That's really fun. <laughs> I love that you can try things. Oh yeah, wasn't there like a secret alleyway beneath Honeydukes? I swear there was. One of the secret alleyways, out of Hogwarts. It's on a Marauder's map. Oh, Pepper's him. <laughs> so cool. Levitating pumpkins, of course. Oh, can I try one of these? Oh, it's gonna make it for me. Holy. Is it making a giant candy floss? Doxy floss, sorry. That's fun. Eating a giant cupcake, oh my gosh. And more cake. Oh my gosh, I'm eating all the cakes. I kind of want to check this out. I don't think we've ever been in here. Steeply and Sons. Looks very sophisticated. I guess I'll have an apple just to balance out all the bad stuff I've been eating. Don't mind me, I'm just going behind the counter and stealing stuff from this bag. This looks like a grandmother's house. <laughs> oh, it's so cute and wonky. I love it. Oh god, I'm stealing stuff from her chest. Okay, we're just gonna check out the three broomsticks real quick. Oh, wait, I'm just gonna, before I do anything... Revenia. Get the field guide page. The three broomsticks, currently run by Serona Ryan, and allegedly as old as Hogsmeade itself, the three broomsticks is a long-standing gathering spot for villagers and Hogwarts students who want to enjoy a butterbeer or fire whiskey. Cute! This feels like a really nice classic old pub. Oh, okay, I'm downing a beer. It's <laughs> gonna keep snacking. I'm literally, I feel like I'm not being fed, because I'm eating everyone's stuff. Oh, a chest. Silver spectacles. I should probably wear some of these at some point. Can I just say, grow growing up in this world must be so much fun. Imagine being able to go on dates in high school, but like in Hogwarts. Amazing. An inquiring mind. Hi. I'm just gonna quickly check out your shop. I love the fireplace. Oh. Okay. I love that this guy is not even reacting to that. But um, I just opened up a secret staircase. Don't mind me, sir. I'll be right back. A 
chest. Okay, I am ready now. Pardon me, sir. Hi. I'm here for the spell crafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda, student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. I Let's take it you've Thomas. had a conjuring lesson then. I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest, creating something out of nothing. Of course, Very it is curious. not without complexity, but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I, too, seeing it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spellcrafts you need. A potting table and a potion station. That sounds yes? fabulous. I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Let's have a look. Let's look at what we have, shall we? Okay, let's have a quick look. Um, so we can have a small potion station, which I don't have to pay for, and a potting table. If you're interested, feel free to take a look around at the rest of my inventory. Oh, I can't afford everything. any of this stuff, sir. Let's go and find Sebastian. I will come back. Thank you very much. Okay, let's go meet Sebastian in the town square. And we'll come back once we are level one in terms of luck. Hi, Sebastian. I officially have all of my supplies. Excellent. Did you get what you needed for your sister? I did. So I suppose the world is our oyster now. Let's see what else we can get up to. Oh, that sounds concerning. Hello? Excuse me, am I fighting a troll? Oh my god. I mean, there's a lot of grown-ass adults here, so I'm hoping they're gonna do something. Oh, well, I guess... Draw it away from the building! Away from the building! Uh-oh. Oh! I well, that one didn't go away from buildings. He has a, a friend. Okay, so I learned dodge. Oh god, we're fighting. <laughs> I'm fighting a battle. Are we weakening him at all? Keep at it. We'll wear him down eventually. Oh, I tried to, um... Wait, ancient that? magic throw. A taste of his own medicine. Nicely done. <laughs> Bam. I'll blind him. Why are you just coming for me, dude? What the heck? Oh my god, Sebastian, are you okay? Okay. Oh, I could have, um... Stupefy him. I need to use stupefy more. That's right, you lumbering louts. He's faltering. Oh, Two more hits to do the job. On Sebastian. Okay, I think we did. Okay, we had a little boss battle. Oh, ancient magic, baby. 
Oh well, now Sebastian knows. Can we trust him with our ancient magic? Troll with the punches. Oh god, everyone will have seen our ancient magic. I Goodness. don't know if we should be concerned about that. A second that. troll. Did you two take on a fully grown troll? By what yourselves? can we say? I suppose so. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. <laughs> are you all right? <laughs> she we looks are. so fabulous saying and it we were to you. Glad to help. It's a I'd bit say of a blur. help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that. The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Yeah, of course, repair our stuff. Singer. Officer Singer. And thank you, again. Oh, sure, she's an officer. Oh, I wanna, um, wait, let's repair, repair this. I just saw a flying page. Oh. Lucky they didn't do more I'll go and see what he wants. Okay, get the page. One get the page. For Officer Singer to worry about. Oh. Yeah. Nice. Um, anything else I need to repairing? Yeah, good me. Statue. I don't know if I'm powerful enough to do a whole building. Oh, wait a second. Revelio. I'm gonna get this field page while we're here. Hengus of Woodcroft. The statue of Hufflepuff Hengus of Woodcroft is believed to be the founder of the village of Hogsmeade after having been driven from his home by muggle persecutors. It's so fun getting all this um, background information. Okay, statue is fixed. Okay, I guess we are fixing this whole building? God damn. We, I can't believe we're powerful enough. That's crazy. <laughs> Repair. Okay, there's one more. This one, I guess? I don't know what I just fixed, but I fixed something. I can go speak to the shopkeeper. Mr. Hill was just singing your praises. Oh, thank you. Huh? Oh, we can make them move. God, everything is insane. It generally feels like I'm walking around Hogwarts. Okay. I I want to talk Hello, to you. Hello, sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself. Augustus Hill, Clothier Extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin. But I can offer you something much more useful. Oh. I am Gladrags with I'm intrigued. And among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. And as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Thank you, sir. That's far too generous of you. I mean, I'm gonna say, sure. Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very like, generous. Like, I'm not gonna of say you. no to free it's gear. The best I can do. Uh, now, now, let's try this on for size, shall we? And then he's got us some school robes, which you know I think we should wear. Gear screen. Your current defense and offense are displayed at the top right of the screen. Select the cloak and the robes gear slot and press X. I would actually love a lace one, a hat. I'd say we've earned a butterbeer or two, wouldn't you? Might help me forget that I was almost pulverized by a troll. I'd say that I agree with you. Perfect. The three broomsticks is just this way. Let's go have a butterbeer. Not sure if I we're actually allowed to drink it. Worthy items, should you be inclined, you're most welcome to peruse my shop at your leisure. Thank you very much. See you later. Let's go to three broomsticks. Assuming it isn't utter bedlam in there, you might even meet Serona, the owner. She's a good one to know. Does she have gossip or something like interesting things? Is this a sp suspicious person? Oh, flying page. Oh, they're having he a secret said meeting. You could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. 
I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who's this child? Oh, he sent the two me. trolls. All you need to know is hmm. that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. Okay, well, he's obviously seen us now. Did they see us? Run! I don't think so. What was they that definitely did. doing with Victor Rookwood? Ranrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. Okay. <laughs> Yikes. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. Hey, Serona. Now, what can I... Oh. There's a face I haven't seen before. It's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one. Single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Cheers to that. Well done. Thank you for this. My pleasure. I will say, trolls in Hogsmeade, that's never happened before. You seem awfully chill about it. <laughs> Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... Uh-oh. Uh how timely. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? Your clientele's not what it used to be, Serona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. Hop off, tell him. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. Me? My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. Hell yeah! I said, my friend is busy. One would think so you were enough blood <laughs> for one day. Come, the office. Bye-bye now. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butterbeer forever. Why are you gonna just wait outside the door? Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. What's I haven't even bet? done anything. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. That's the worst part. I literally haven't even spoken Trolls? to him ever. Ranrock and Rookwood? What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. I think we've got a good friend in him, you know. And on that note, I think we should head back to the castle. I'm a bit concerned now. Not gonna lie. About going outside? Nice meeting you. Alright. Let's hope he's not waiting for us. Out here. I also don't think we should speak in the street. I'm certainly glad Serona was there. Told you she was one of the good ones. Sorry, guys, it's my bedtime that. again. <laughs> she didn't seem at all intimidated by Rookwood and Harlow. I think you'll need to tell yeah, me what a why badass. Victor Rookwood has you in his sights. But we can talk later. For the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley's certain to hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. Don't want to risk another detention for getting back after hours. You must return to your common room for the night. Access the map. Okay. This might be best. Select Hogwarts. Boop. And then fast travel to your common room. Boop. Alright, I guess we're traveling. Alright. Quest complete. Welcome to Hogsmeade. <gasps> Is this our owl? Hey. Oh, level 6. Let's go. Oh my gosh. The world is our oyster. What shall we do today? We should name our owl first of all. I might name my owl Felix, which I know is actually the phoenix's name. 
but I just think it's such a beautiful animal name. Or Luna. Luna is cute. I quickly... Actually, no. I want to check out my gear first. I want to sort out my gear. And then I'm going to have a look at the quests. I mean, we look cool. <laughs> it just feels really strange wearing these around. Oh, fuck it. I'm going to wear them. All right. I'm just going to check out our quests now. So we can regroup with Perse Professor Fig. However, we can also... Um, do some dueling. You have received an owl post. Fun. Owl post will be sent when your characters have met requests or updates for you. Select Professor Fake to see his owl post. That is so cute! I love it! Come and see me. I've discovered something in the locket we found at Gringotts. Oh my gosh, this is so exciting. I'm starting to get tired because it's really late. I'm supposed to be in bed right now. Oh. Something's definitely up here. <laughs> portrait of Barufio. Barufio, sorry. Portrait of Barufio. This portrait depicts the wizard Barufio, framed for his brain elixir, and as an example of what happens when incantations are improperly spoken. He once said S instead of F and found himself on the floor with a buffalo on his chest. <laughs> Shit happens, my dude. Ravenia. Oh. Wait. What just happened? Where am I? What the? I mean... Okay. What the? What is this place? <laughs> is that everything? Okay. I completely missed um, what it gave me, so that's fine. Let's go find Lucid. Oh. Gryffindor Tower. Field page. This map depicts Argyllshire. I'm not sure how to pronounce this. A region in Scotland which contains the Hebrids. Um, Hebrids. Hebrids. I'm so sorry if I mispronounce this. Native home of the Hebridian Black Dragon. Chest. Glad you could make it. Clock Tower. Lucan's just over there. Okay. Also. Oh, that did something, huh? So that's what we have to do. Cool. Uh, let's go in. So this is the dueling club, huh? Can I help you? Hi, Lisa. Nice to meet you. Sebastian told me to you see like my you glasses. <laughs> if Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. I coordinate duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. I kind of, you know, pushed him off a table. I did take him down a peg. <laughs> I'm gonna say that. I'm gonna be cocky. Have a knack for dueling. Then you've come to the right place. How does cross ones work exactly? You show up. I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. It's our okay. way of determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. Interested? Yeah, that sounds fun. I'll join. Of course. Dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in crossed ones, you could duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. Oh, maybe you so, can ask Natty to come along. That'd be fun. To the ring. Uh, yeah, let's Get try it. The ring. Spectacular! Let the fireworks begin! Marvellous! Fabulous! Splendid! We'll make you regret Sick hat, my dude. Okay. Break through yellow shields with control spells like Levitation Spell Levioso. Target lock R3 um, lets, your en um, lets you track enemies without aiming. Use R to change targets while locked. Okay. Um, so we're gonna do Levioso. Levioso and Stupefy, I think, is how I won last time. Is that all you've got? 
Ah, no! Oh god, I need to take a potion. Yeah, I'm not doing well though. I feel like I need to um Nice work. Heal up. Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. There's Thank strong you. competition ahead, but keep this up and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Guys, I'm just gonna warn you, I'm gonna get obsessed I with shall. this and become the school now, champion. <laughs> it's time to organize these duels, but check with me later. I may have something lined up for you. Thank you so much, Lucy. Again, congratulations on your first cross Thank you. victory. Well fought. See you later. And it's good practice Hope too. See you back here again. Yes. All right. Finished the first one. And also that means we are now better friends. Let's talk Next to him. Next time you need a partner for Cross Swans, don't hesitate to call on me. Oh, thanks, dude. I feel like we're going to be really good friends. I like him. Um, cool. Let's check the next quest that we can do. We can regroup with Professor Frigg. I was going to say Frigg. <laughs> Professor Frigg. Okay. Um, let's see if we can go closer. Hello there. Perhaps you can help me. Oh. Yeah, maybe. Arthur. Hello. Why are you calling me? I was, yes. Someone casually Thought setting themselves on fire in the background. <laughs> joining me for a bit of an adventure. Following a treasure map to be precise. Slight respite that from sounds battling really fun. the old troll, you. I should think. Asked Poppy if she'd be interested as well, but couldn't drag her away from her puff skein. I found two maps lying about, both leading to locations around Hogwarts. Care to have a look at one? Of course. Yes. Following a Hogwarts treasure map. Count me in. Wonderful. Hogwarts fascinates me. You can keep whatever treasure lies at the end of your map. I'll be satisfied just knowing where it leads. Thank you for sharing. Very well. I shall take a look if I can find the time. Fair enough. Thank you for sharing. Meet me back here if you find anything. Sounds like a very fun challenge. Okay, so there's a dragon. A skeleton of some sort. This looks like it's the outer courtyard. Oh. Professor Fake, if my schedule wasn't congested enough, the Ministry has charged me with arranging the rather inconvenient arrival of a new student at Hogwarts. A fifth year, if you can believe. Professor Weasley insists that, if, that they will need an escort and a mentor to help them acclimatize before term begins. I have assigned the task to you. Please see Professor Weasley for details. Professor Phineas... <laughs> Nigella's black headmaster. Wow, he seems so, um, you know, worried about students. Hello. Revelia. Oh my gosh, your office is very cool, dude. Let me get this chest first. What a room! Look at this, you guys. Very cool. Let's wait for him. Hey, Professor Fig. Professor, I'm glad to see you. And I, you. Thank Merlin you're in one piece. I heard about the attack. Trolls in Hogsmeade? Hmm. Sir, the trolls were wearing armor. It had that dark glow, like the dragon collar. Goblin silver. Ranrock used it to control the dragon. But how? And why send trolls to... They were there because of me. I overheard Ranrock talking with Victor Rookwood. Ranrock was in Hogsmeade Interesting. with Rookwood. The trolls were Ranrock's distraction so that Rookwood could get to me. And he would have, had Serona and the patrons at the Three Broomsticks not intervened. This is great news indeed. If Ranrock's goblins and dark wizards are after you, they want what we found in that vault. So about the goblins at Gringotts. Speaking of the vault, do you think that Ranrock is working with any of Obviously the goblins Obviously he at is. I the did not. Gringotts was goblins aren't typically the friendliest of beings, but they have a great deal of integrity. Now, well, some of them, I the guards. I dare say, after what happened to that poor banker, the goblins at Gringotts are no followers of Ranrock. Okay, they want the locket. They're after the locket. You said you discovered something in it. Yes, yes. I discovered an inscription. When I read it aloud, this map appeared. Clever enchantment. It's a map of Hogwarts, to be sure. But I do not know where it leads. Up to no good. It leads to the library. 
The restricted section, to be precise, and a bit beyond. I see traces of magic there on the map. Looks like I water. suspected you would see something. Shall we go? I appreciate your enthusiasm, and I'm eager to discover what we may find there as well. But if our experience at Gringotts, let alone what happened to Miriam, taught me anything, it's that the path we're on is terribly dangerous. I'd like you to work with Professor. Too late Hagen to go back now, though. To be fair. Continue. But sir, how dangerous could the library be? Perhaps we're only after a book. Perhaps we are only after a book, but we should be prepared. For I think anything. it's always good Once to tell more your people. Once you've magic further, come and see me. Their strength I'll in let Professor groups, know to you know. You. Okay. Well, thank you, and see you soon. Wait, I think is this part of the treasure map? Okay, that didn't do anything. Repair it. Something quite satisfying about using the message, isn't there? Oh, he totally just saw me. Okay, so that didn't do anything. Huh. A rhinoceros skeleton. I'm on the right track. Okay. Can some kind soul help me. Uh, I'll um get your side quest and you then right? keep going. Don't you know who I am? Zenobia Noak. Zenobia Noak. Everyone at school hates for no reason. If that is how you introduce yourself, um, why does everyone hate you? Everyone hates you. Why? Because Hogwarts is full of bullies and spoil sports. Leander Pruitt's one of the worst. That no talent moon mind. I wanted to make some new friends, and so I brought my collection down to the common room. My gobstone collection, that is. I was hoping someone would want to play. Are you familiar with gobstones? Little balls, like Are marbles. we gonna play gobstones? And if you lose, they spray you with a foul-smelling liquid. Interesting. Gobstones. I'm happy to try Sounds anything like in this world, challenge. to be honest. That's what I tried to tell everyone. <sighs> People can be so cruel. Just because they're sprayed all over with smelly gobstone spit, it's their own fault for losing. Imelda is one of the worst losers. Everett and Astoria are terrible as well. And now those poor losers have taken my gobstones and hidden them in very high places all over the school. Sounds like they overreacted. I'd have done the same. Oh, well, let's just, let's just make her feel better. Oh, rather an overreaction on their part. I'll say. Anyway, I can't work out how to get them back on my own. I don't think I know the necessary spells yet. I need someone, perhaps a selfless and Sorry. talented fifth year to help me. Um, okay. I'll see what I can do. I'd appreciate the help. If you do find all of my That's gobstones, okay, I'll go try. do come and see me Might again. Might as well. I'll be back to playing Snake Pit and Jackstone by myself in no time. All right, see ya. The Dedalian keys are back. Aren't they brilliant? I will come talk to you in just a second. I'm guessing this is where we have to go. And then there's something we need to Accio. Revelio. It's like a portrait with a house and trees. This stairwell looks promising. This looks like the portrait from the map. Now, where's the treasure? Ah! Okay, uh, that did something. There was a doorway hidden within the portrait. That's so cool! Okay, we I got the chest. came of Arthur's search. Oh, I didn't see what we got. The Dedalian keys are back. Let's speak to this brilliant? girl to get Is the side quest. Right? Yes, I'm sorry. I'm just... I'm Nelly, by the way. Nice I'm just to meet so you, Nelly. Sorry, Dedalian my brain just back. farted. The what keys? The Dedalian keys. Surely you've seen them flying about. Rumor no. is that a former headmistress, Professor Moll, conjured them to protect the contents of certain locked cabinets years ago. Professor Black couldn't be bothered to disenchant the keys, and they appear every few years. You should try to catch one. Why would I do that? Okay. Each key will lead you to a locked cabinet somewhere in the castle. <gasps> if you can manage to get the key into the cabinet lock, not okay, an easy great. task. You I can't wait to start unlocking these. Okay, great. 
Let's Perhaps I'll give it a go. I hope you do. In fact, I think I heard one of the keys in the astronomy tower. You should listen for them. Okay, astronomy tower. I Noted. hope you follow a few keys at least. Thank if you. If you manage to open a cabinet, I'd love to know what you find. If anything, I'd better keep an eye on high places around oh, the school so it's up for there. some obvious cobblestones. Revelio. Oh. Wyvern Fountain. This fountain in the Transfiguration Courtyard has a likeness of a wyvern on top and serves as a relaxing place for students to gather. Despite rumors to the contrary, possibly started by Sir Cadogan, this is most assuredly not meant to be the wyvern of Y, slain by the lively knight in spite of himself. Okay, let's quickly Made speak to him. Made any progress with your treasure map? Yes, Hello, I found Arthur. it. Thought you might like to know that my map led to a doorway hidden within a portrait. Oh, how clever! Mine led to the boathouse. <gasps> I would have loved Barely to have seen the, the boathouse. before I saw the headmaster coming. He shooed me out of there, but not before I got a few galleons richer. Galleons? What did you find? Damn. I found what I believe is an authentic historian's uniform. Oh, that's lucky. Seems as though we both had success. Very cool. Glad I enlisted you to join me. Awesome. Well, on to the next Hogwarts mystery. Wonder Thanks so much for including me in this. That's awesome. Anything interesting. And we just leveled up. Amazing. Let me okay, amazing. It's good to know that this is where they're hidden. Nice. Oh. Feel like I page. This tapestry depicts the wizard Barnabas the Barmy's foolish attempt to train trolls for ballet. <laughs> One can only imagine the impact on the art had he succeeded. I would have totally gone to see that performance if they enjoyed doing the ballet. Oh, so I'm guessing this is the cabinet. <gasps> A Dedalian key. I wonder where it might lead me. Oh, we need to follow it. Come back. Yes, that's where it is. That's where the sound was. There's the cabinet. How do I get this key in there? You can slap it. This is so brutal. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so sorry. Excellent. Yes. Okay. <laughs> oh. An old coin. Perhaps Nelly knows Looks like the Ravenclaw means. coin. Yeah, house token. Were you able to follow one of the Dedalian keys? Yes, I found one. Hello, Nelly. I managed to get a Dedalian key into its lock. Mm -hmm. Brilliant. What did you find in the cabinet? A curious token of some sort. A house token. Looks like some sort of house token. I bet it unlocks house chests. I call them house chests. I've seen the one in Gryffindor and heard they're also in the other common rooms as well. Keep Can I go out. in there? Oh my gosh, I, I thought I would you only be able to go into the so Ravenclaw effort, one. The prize must be something grand. Yeah, I can't wait. I should see this through and find the Ravenclaw house chest. Right, you guys. I'm going to end this episode right here. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure that if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more. In the next episode, we're going to report back to Professor Hecate. We're going to hunt down some more keys. We're going to try and find some of these gobstones. Maybe get some more dueling in. Maybe do some more exploring. Obviously, more exploring. And I can't wait. Maybe we can go check out some of the other common rooms. I'm so excited. Anyway, thank you so much for watching and see you soon. Bye.